This trick with a dishwasher towel will dry wet dishes in just five minutes and without any wiping. Do you ever find that your dishwasher doesn't dry the dishes? What do you do when you want to take out plates, bowls, cups, and containers, but they're still wet? I used to take a towel and dry such dishes by hand. It took a lot of time, but I didn't like the water streaks it left behind. This problem often occurs with plastic containers. Plastic dishes don't retain heat, so they dry more slowly. You often take them out of the dish, washer still wet. Sometimes even regular dishes or cups are wet. However, there is a way to ensure that dishes, including plastic ones, are dry. You won't see a single drop of water on them anymore. The problem will disappear in just a few minutes. All you need is a towel, or even two. But you won't be wiping the dishes with them at all. The towel will do all the work for you. After a while, the dishes will be dry. Just use a regular dish towel. When the dishwasher finishes its cycle, pass it through the dishwasher door and close it. The dry towel will absorb all the moisture from the dishwasher. You can hang even two towels through the dishwasher door. The effect will be 100%. A small terry towel will also work very well. In just a few minutes, your dishes will be dry. I clean the washing machine regularly. Dirt and lime scale disappear. The washing machine is clean, and the laundry always smells fresh. Apply toothpaste to the inner glass of the door. Take half a lemon and spread the paste. Do this especially at the edges, where residue from water and detergents often accumulates. Once you've cleaned the entire glass, toss the lemon into the washing machine drum. Now, focus on the door seal in the washing machine. This is the area where most dirt accumulates and mold. Sprinkle this area with baking soda. It will remove dirt, mold spores, and eliminate unpleasant odors. After doing this, close the washing machine. Open the detergent drawer and spray it with vinegar. All compartments. Vinegar removes scale, detergent, residue, and mold. If you clean the washing machine irregularly, mold will never appear. Close the drawer and run the washing machine on a standard program. Toothpaste, lemon, baking soda, and vinegar will clean the interior of the washing machine and eliminate deposits and lime scale. These ingredients also eliminate mold spores, which may be responsible for the unpleasant odor coming from the washing machine. When the washing machine finishes, open it and remove the lemon. You'll immediately notice that the entire interior shines. Wipe it dry, and it will be cleaner than ever. The detergent drawer will also be cleaner. During the next laundry cycle, you'll notice that your clothes will smell wonderfully. You don't have to worry about the smell of mustiness and mold. Toss a wet wipe into your dark laundry load. This is a handy trick to solve an annoying issue. Most people have no clue about this hack. Turns out, wet baby wipes have more uses than you might think. They come in handy when you're doing dark laundry. All you need to do is throw two damp wet wipes into the washing machine drum and set a regular cycle. Often during the laundry process, some lint and stubborn hairs get stuck on certain clothes. They're particularly noticeable on dark fabrics. The wet wipe trick comes to the rescue. Its fabric attracts and captures lint and hairs. Instead of sticking to your clothes, they end up on the wet wipe. After the laundry is done, simply toss the wipes in the trash. Your black clothes will look good as new, and you won't have to deal with those annoying lint particles. Hydraulics are alarming. Most people use laundry capsules incorrectly, leading to internal damage in washing machines. You won't Improperly used capsules can clog pipes, filters, and even damage our clothes. All because of one detail that unfortunately most of us don't know. Capsules appeared in stores a few years ago and quickly became a sales hit. A portion of laundry detergent is placed in a water-soluble coating. It is this coating that can cause a huge problem. You can only use them when you set the washing machine program to the appropriate temperature. The capsule doesn't dissolve properly at too low a temperature. Its residue can build up in the water drainage pipes, creating sludge. This is later responsible for the unpleasant smell coming from the washing machine. Plumbers call this the foul side effect of using capsules. See what happens to the capsule when we use it at a temperature of 86 degrees Fahrenheit. For the purposes of this experiment, we put it in a jar. 
After 15 minutes, the coating still hasn't dissolved in the water. This is evidence that capsules won't work well during short washing cycles either. Their residues will certainly accumulate in the pipes and on clothes. The situation is different at temperatures above 104 degrees Fahrenheit. The capsule dissolves completely. When using capsules, remember to set the washing machine to a higher temperature and longer washing time. Do you often use capsules? Did you know how to use them correctly? Since I started using this trick, I no longer throw away dirty or old shoes. Stains, dirt, dust, and unpleasant odors disappear quickly. You can also rescue sports shoes, Crocs, or even other soiled items using this method. All you need are these small balls. Since I learned how to make them, my sneakers, Crocs, and even socks are always clean. To make these balls, you need two small cups of baking soda. Add two tablespoons of any dishwashing liquid and one tablespoon of hydrogen peroxide. Mix all the ingredients into a uniform paste. You can now start shaping this paste. It's best to make smaller balls from it. I usually use similar ones more often. One such ball is enough to remove stains and dirt from a particular item. You can transfer them to a jar for storage. One screw top jar is enough. To clean sneakers, take a bowl of warm water. Put the shoes in it. Now take one ball, crumble it in your fingers, and start cleaning the shoes. You can clean the soles directly with it. You can also dissolve it in water and clean the sneakers with a brush. A few minutes are enough to remove dirt. Baking soda and hydrogen peroxide work well on many stains, and the dishwashing liquid enhances their effectiveness. You can clean crooks in the same way. The dirt disappears quickly, and there are no more stains. Then, just rinse the footwear well, and you're done. You can use these cleaning balls for shoes, socks, clothes, and even other items that need cleaning. Throw ice into the dryer, and wrinkles on clothes will disappear. This trick will be loved by people who hate ironing clothes. When your clothes have visible wrinkles, you can address this issue easily and without using an iron. Ironing clothes is a hassle and a waste of time for many people. They just don't want to take out the ironing board and turn on the iron. But if you have a dryer or a washer dryer at home, you're in luck. Take your wrinkled clothes with visible creases. They often appear if we keep folded clothes in the closet instead of hanging them on hangers. Sometimes wrinkles appear if we don't take out the dry laundry immediately. Put three to five such items into the drum, add a handful of ice cubes, start the drying cycle for about 15 minutes. During this time, the moisture from the ice cubes will eliminate wrinkles while the dryer is working. Clothes will be smooth without ironing. Depending on the fabric, you'll see the effect immediately after taking them out of the dryer. Just 10 or 15 minutes is often enough for the dryer to iron your clothes for you all thanks to a few ice cubes.